Today, I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Star Wars Legion Rebel Fleet Troopers unit expansion. I've never used these guys on the table before. It's my first time ever buying them, so I figured I would unbox it for you guys. So you guys can all see what's in the package, see how it comes. They seemed interesting. Uh, I don't know if I like them more than the regular troopers, so I figured I'd get them, try them out, and see how I feel. So the box comes with bases, obviously. I believe there's eight. Then we got the instructions on how to put them together. Oh, I was wrong. There's not eight, there's seven. So, the thing I love about this game is how easy the minis are to put together. That's probably my favorite part about the entire game. Everything just fits together how it should with a little bit of glue. You don't need to pin anything. It's just It just works. They did a really good job on that. I love Fantasy Flight. Let's see here. The tokens. We got three suppression tokens, one standby. We got... I don't know what the other token's called in the corner there, that diamond. I should know that, but I don't. We got the aim, the dodge, and the rebel trooper activation token. There's the card. We got ready one. They perform a standby action to gain one aim token. The thing that worried me about them is they're only range two. So I think the best way to play them is to put them into a position where they can't really see anything, go into standby. That way, if anything moves toward them, they can shoot them. I could be wrong about that. Like I said, I've never played it before. Let's see what we got here. The Fleet Trooper. MPL 57. So that's nice. It's range 3. Alright, so just the standard. Add one Fleet Trooper to the unit card. We got the Scatter Gun. Two Red Dice and Pierce. That's good. Grappling hooks, expert climbers. I could see that coming up depending on the scenario. And the base terrain and whatnot. And then the barrage trooper with the blast and ion. Or impact, not ion, sorry. Impact grenades. Useful. So I'm just going to go through and show you just a quick unput together view of each one of the troopers. They're individually wrapped makes them super easy to put together because you know exactly what pieces go on which mini. Like I say, they couldn't have done a better job at packaging these things and making them just easy to put together. So many games, it's such a pain. You have to pin stuff, you gotta shave stuff down, you gotta glue it and just hold it there for hours to make it sit and then it's fragile. This game, they're already exactly how they should be. It's a little dab of glue and they're put together and they're done. Here's what they look like when they're all put together and glued. Like I said, there's seven of them. We got some basic troopers. I believe this one's the scatter gun. And we got that barrage trooper right here. These guys should be neat. I'm interested to see how they do. Uh, I'm still curious to see how they are compared to the regular troopers. But I think they got some use to them. Other people seem to take them, so there's got to be a good reason for it. I just have never taken them myself, so I don't know what that reason is yet. But I'm excited to try them out. So I hope you guys liked this video. Uh, my first ever unboxing video. So if you guys liked it, tell me about it. I'll do more of them. Let me know. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you had a good time.